From Spain to Romania to India, stuffed capsicum is popular across continents. However, every region has its own version. And what I am going to make today is my take on this recipe. I'm going to start with making the filling first. So heat some oil. Just a little bit. Once the oil is nice and hot, I'm going to add the onions. Just cook the onions for a few seconds. Finely chopped garlic. Finely chopped green chilies. Finely chopped and de-seeded tomatoes. Finely chopped boiled potatoes. Finely chopped paneer. If you don't have paneer, you can only make the filling with potatoes. That's fine as well. Black olives. And time for the seasoning ingredients. Red chilli powder. Red chilli sauce. Just a little bit of sugar, some dried oregano, coriander leaves or even freshly chopped parsley is fine and a little bit of salt. This filling is ready and now I am going to turn off the flame and let it cool down for like 5 minutes. While the filling is cooling down, I am going to chop up the capsicums. So take medium sized capsicums, uh, red, yellow, green, whatever you have. Chop it up into half. And now I am just going to de-seed this. So you have a nice cup of capsicum. So in this way, just chop up all your bell peppers. The capsicums are nicely cleaned up and the filling is cooled down a little bit. And now I'm going to add some mozzarella in the filling. So I have some grated mozzarella over here. I'm going to leave the rest for garnishing on top. Mix it well. And now I'm going to fill this filling in the capsicum cups. The filling should be in the level of the capsicum. I'm going to garnish it with a little bit of mozzarella. And now I'm going to place these capsicums on a baking tray and bake them at 180 degrees Celsius for 10 to 12 minutes. These are ready to go in the oven. These are beautifully baked and out of the oven and you can see the beautiful cheese melting all over the capsicum and they are ready to serve. You can even use tomatoes instead of capsicum with the same filling 
and it tastes equally good. Let me know your experiment with this recipe in the comment section below. Subscribe to the channel. See you next time. Bye bye.